Bonner versus City of Aurora et al. Daryl Kilmer and Mari Newman of Kilmer, Lane and Newman, LLP, and Andrew Silverman of Hockstadt, Straw, Strauss, and Silverman, PC. On December 3rd, 2003, several members of the Aurora Police Department ambushed and shot a young, unarmed black man in the back multiple times during a SWAT operation. My son was wrong, doing the wrong thing, that he should have been put in jail. To shoot somebody in the back three times, point blank, unarmed, never seeing their hands, assuming that they have a weapon. In bringing this case, they were motivated more than anything else by the desire to make sure that no one else was killed as their son had been. Bobby and Brenda Bonner, which is Jamal's parents, were very insistent that any result of this case be publicly available, that the police be publicly accountable for their conduct. They were never out for the money. They were out to make sure that important changes were made to make sure that people in Aurora were actually safe and that they wouldn't be killed by their own police department. That's what we want, change. That's why we're fighting this fight. This was a hard fought case. Municipalities, especially police, are profoundly stubborn in cases such as this. Um, Aurora has had a particularly difficult uh, history with its relations between its police department and the minority community especially. Given that most juries are very deferential to law enforcement, substantial verdicts and settlements are difficult to reach. They were pleased to settle the case in a way that furthered the family's goal of creating fundamental change within the Aurora Police Department. Aurora agreed that their recruitment processes uh, will expand and they'll look more into minority communities so that they can recruit members of the minority community into the police force itself. Obviously, Aurora is a very diverse community and the police can't relate with the people who live there if they don't look something like them. The city of Aurora agreed that no more will they enforce prostitution stings with uh, heavily armed SWAT members. While the settlement included a significant award, the law firm is most proud of the many non-monetary elements of the settlement designed to increase public safety, increase police accountability, and facilitate the family's healing. The apology was a key component of this case, perhaps the single most important component from the Bonner's perspective, because it was the first time in several years that the city of Aurora actually acknowledged in clear fashion that it had done wrong. On behalf of my firm, Kilmer Lane and Newman, and on behalf of Andy Silverman and his firm, and definitely on behalf of the Bonner family. Uh, we'd like to thank CTLA for this opportunity and this uh, recognition for case of the year status. We're very proud of the result and mostly we're proud of our clients in this case and uh, we appreciate the recognition. Thank you. I just want to thank the CTLA for nominating us as one of the finalists for the case of the year along with the Bonner family who are just incredibly beautiful, wonderful people and my firm Kilmer Lane and Newman. Thanks CTLA. On behalf of my firm, Hogstad, Strauss, Strauss and Silverman and the Bonner family, I would like to say thank you for nominating us in this case for CTLA's Case of the Year.